Hello and uh, welcome to this uh, review of a vast um, browser. And uh, I've been given requests to do reviews on various browsers or discussions on various browsers uh, because there's a lot of them out there. And I thought today I would talk about a vast uh, browser. There's also another browser that's uh, under the same company, uh, AVG Secure Browser. But I thought I would do um, a vast browser since a lot of people seem to enjoy using it. I just installed it yesterday. And my first impressions of the uh, browser basically are that it's all right. I mean, it's got some features in it that uh, will keep you protected while you're on the internet, which is nice. Um, if you click this little um, green chat box, check box right here, um, a uh, safety and uh, privacy, a security and privacy center opens up. And you can see all the stuff you can do with this. Um, if you have AVG installed, this will already be um, indicating that it's installed. Um, also has a secure banking feature. So like if you do a lot of banking and stuff, um, you turn this on and it will allow you to securely uh, shop online. Uh, secure browser VPN, VPN, I do not recommend installing this VPN. Um, because it's only a free trial. All these other boxes that you see that I have checked, I recommend that you check them. There's also a uh, a privacy cleaner, which is you know really good. I've not tested it myself, but I do know that uh, it does work. There's also a private mode. So like if you want to go into private mode, like if you're doing, um, like I said, shopping or anything like that, that's where the private mode comes in. And um, you might notice that when you go to the extensions option, that there's not anything to add extensions. Um, if you go to the left, like on Chrome, there's a deal that allows you to add extensions. So what you end up having to do is you end up having to go to the um, add-on add -on store for Avast. You end up having to go in there and you can see all the add-ons that they have. But if you don't see your add-on listed here, you keep scrolling down and you can actually install the add-ons from Chrome because this is Chrome. It's kind of a Chrome knockoff, I like to call it. Um, now, someone called me, I was talking to a friend of mine yesterday, and she was telling me she had trouble um, viewing PDFs in Chrome. And this is Chrome, kind of. This is like a little Chrome, like I said, it's a Chrome knockoff. Um, and I downloaded this yesterday. Say again, I just downloaded it yesterday. And so I tried to download a PDF. And that's one of the things that she could not do is download a PDF from her computer and print it out. So I'm going to show you that with this, it actually opens up the PDF. And you can see I've got the PDF open. Um, And it works really well. I'm very impressed with the speed. And um, I added my own extension, my own little widgets up here or uh, extensions uh, so that when I'm surfing, it automatically tells me if a website or uh, website is safe or not. Um, so if I want to know. You want to know where to find this, I'll go ahead and 
I'll leave a link in the description for it. But if you just do a search for free, um, a free Avast Secure Browser, uh, you'll find it here. Now it's going to, the Dr. Web thing is going to tell me it's not secure and it's going to open in a private window. So um, if you do use the, pri the, the Dr. Web extension, it's going to tell you that. Regular browsers versus a vast browser. You can see all the stuff that it protects you against. Scroll down, you can hear a little video about it. Really not much more to tell about this, except uh, go ahead and try it. If you have questions, put them in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them. Hope everyone has a good day.